Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Yes, as you can see from the title, this thumbnail, what this video is about. Let's go and get into it. Let's get to the chase. Um, as you guys know, there is a virus going around. A corona. The name of it is coronavirus. Um, from how things are looking, the CDC says not to panic, but prepare yourself. So guess what? Your girl is still over preparing. No, I'm not trying to make this video to scare anyone, but I'm just preparing myself. You know what I'm saying? Because like they say, we cannot see this virus. So it, 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 it can be easy contracted. So yeah, let's get into it. Today's video, I am going to be showing you guys um, some items that you can go purchase if you don't have at home already to disinfect your home. Like I say, now, if you have already got this virus, you know, it's kind of a bit too late, you know, to be trying to disinfect the in anything or whatever, but just to prepare yourself for the virus and to keep yourself from getting the virus. Um, so let's get into it. Um, so the first item that is on my list is mask. Y'all, I don't have them to show to you guys because literally I went to three different stores today and they were all sold out. So guess what? Your girl ain't the only one that's on this preparation. Like, I see that now. <laughs> But anyways, um, yeah, I met the mask. They are very important because they cover your mouth and your nose. And from what they are saying, that is how the um virus is contracted. But anyways, um, the next item on my list is Lysol spray. As you can see, it says kill over a hundred illness cause germs, which you know the coronavirus comes from germs that we cannot see bacteria that we cannot see so um keeping this in your home disinfecting your home by spraying this you know it kills 99 percent of germs next on my list is lysol wipes um keeping your counters your furniture all that all that wiped down and um these are great, the disinfected white. And also, if you look on the back of the can, on um, the Lysol can, um, you can see that it says right here, um, human coronavirus. So, literally, um, these wipes gonna be your best friend, right? Because it says it's on the bottle, you know what I'm saying? It it um, disinfect these things. And it, it got more on the list, but we're talking about the coronavirus. So, yeah, it's on there, you guys. Look on the back of your Lysol can and you will see it. So, um, the next item on my list is hand sanitizer. Of course, y'all, we do not, most of us don't wash our hands. Just be honest. Most of us don't even wash our hands before we eat. But literally, if you do not wash your hands quite often for a amount, um, amount, uh, well, I'm going to say for a certain amount of time because they say you're supposed to wash your hands for, I think, two minutes or something like that. But anyways, if you are not the type of person that washes your hand often, keep you some hand sanitizer on hand. I'm just like, just to be honest, you know, nothing embarrassing because sometimes I forget to wash my hands also on um, certain occasions. So yeah, keep you some hand sanitizer on hand. The next item on my list is bleach. If you cannot get your hands on some disinfectant wipes, grab some bleach, do it old school, get your rag and bleach your cameras down, disinfect your cameras because I'll say, also it says on the bleach, um, 99, kills 99% of germs. And like I said, this virus is a type of germ, bacteria, or whatever you want to call it. Go on and get you some bleach. And also on my list is gloves. Of course, you're going to need gloves when you, you know, using bleach and all that type of stuff. But gloves is another way that you can protect yourself because, of course, what we do with our hands, we eat with our hands, we wipe um, our mouth with our hands, we blow our nose with our hands, we do all these things with our hands. 
So gloves would be another protection that we could use for this virus. Y'all, like literally, some people may think, oh, this girl is crazy. She's making these YouTube videos saying this virus, this and this virus, that. But y'all, it is best to be prepared than sorry. Like, I'm sorry. Like, um, for those of you that don't know, I am in Mississippi, so of course a lot of people don't come in and out of this um, state, but it doesn't matter, like it is best to be prepared. CDC has already said, like I say, don't panic, but prepare. So for them to say that y'all, this virus could reach our state. We might, well, we might as well as just accept it for what it is and just you know, live with it and try to stay safe. But anyways, you guys, if you like this video, you found this video helpful, be sure to subscribe, give this video a thumbs up, and anybody that's out there like me and, and prepare, go on and drop a comment below. Let me know what you're doing to prepare for this coronavirus, because like I say, <laughs> Y'all just don't know, like, this could be a disaster for the world, like, literally, because we can't see this thing, you know? So, yeah. Like I said, I'm praying for this nation, these countries to overcome this thing, but all we can do right now is pray. So, like I say, you guys, be sure to subscribe, leave a comment, like this video, let's get it, let's overcome this virus don't let it overcome us just stay positive do not panic you know what i'm saying so yeah i'll see you guys on my next video